on the goodness day. Hi everybody! Tula Pink, Sarah Filkey, no, that's here at International Quote Market in Houston, Texas, where the weather is horrible. But we are talking about our block of the month for 24-25, Big Woods, designed by the incomparable Sarah Filkey, my real life best friend, yay for us. Um, so this is the quilt that she designed. I have nothing to do with the yes, design. I just get yeah. to attach my name to it for glory and clout. But, the I'm in the so it's an applique quilt. We've taught you how to EPP. We've explored machine piecing with rulers. We are now diving into applique. And Sarah taught me how to applique. So I know she can teach you because I'm borderline hopeless, but I've gotten pretty good. It's, I, I'm decent. I can hold my own. But so here's this quilt. This is what I'm super excited about. So it's designed almost like with beginners in mind. So they're big pieces with open blocks, but each month there will be sort of add-on pieces that you can, yeah, like little extras. So like there might be little little extra like Mr. Nasha. Probably will come. I haven't quite decided yet. But he probably will come with some little acorns that you can sort of fill in. So you can leave it sort of like a little bit more spacious with more negative space. Negative people like the word negative space. It's, it's, it's lots of room for beautiful quilting if you're in the shape. Lots of room for beautiful lots quilting. So you can leave it with more negative space if you're not ready to take on sort of that density that applique can bring. But if you are a more experienced applicator, or you start this and you get real, real into it, which you're totally gonna, then we're, she's gonna, I did not do anything. She's gonna provide little extras that you can add in to sort of fill in the space if you want a denser look. So there's really a choose your own adventure vibe to this, which I, I think is super cool because I love to start with a pattern, but I always wanna make it my own. Yeah. The idea is that um, not everybody is going to want to do a hugely complicated applique book. Right. I understand that, even though that's what my jam is. Like I love the more the better. But what we're going to do here is for it to be as simple as possible for you to start if you are not into applique and never done this before. And if you are and you're one of my crazy applique people or one of the other crazy applique people out there There's in the world, <laughs> Then we will be adding a bunch of other really fun things in. And the other nice thing about it is that all these little extras on the water, like the little shrooms and what have you, can all kind of come out of your piecing and there's all okay. kinds of fun can stuff with them. Sorry to interrupt. Get out of the way. There, again, did you get a look at these mushrooms? These are basically the cutest mushrooms I've ever seen in my entire life. And I'm obsessed. I think that was the first thing you showed me. And it was like mushrooms everywhere. But like there's mushrooms. I want to just go because I didn't. I don't feel like we've had a chance to like go through each of the animals. So we've got the best mushrooms of all time. This little yes. woodpecker. That's what I'm assuming that is a, yeah, woodpecker. He's a woodpecker. But like, look at how cute these animals are. And if you look at these pieces, they're not crazy. Like they're not. They're tiny. not crazy tiny pieces. They're like pretty decent size. Look at my big old ham hocks. Even the little tiny this. pointy bits on it, they're really... Okay. They're like rounded. They're yeah. yeah, and uh, one thing I will say, when Sarah taught me how to make the points, like she has a crazy trick for that that is really, really effective. And my points are like the best part of my applique because of your technique. So Sarah is, and I can say this about you because you can't say about yourself, um, Sarah is one of the best quilting teachers I've ever met. And so if you want to learn from somebody who's not only an expert at the craft, but a really, really thoughtful, incredibly excellent instructor and educator, if you've ever wanted to learn applique, this is the time and this is the place to do it because there's no one better to teach it to you. Um, and it's not just because we're friends, like I'm not that nice. Um, She's not. Like if she was terrible at it, I would let you know. Anyway, but we've got, so then we've got the little house with the tree, the owl, a bear with the little bees. The bear's, the bear's wearing, wearing a jacket. He's wearing a jumper. Yeah. A bear in a jumper. That's Australian for sweater. Um, we've got more mushrooms. I'm just obsessed with the mushrooms. What is that? Look at the owl though. Hi, buddy. We've got flowers. We've got a deer. We've 
got a little skunk muddy. The wolf, I mean, my oh, the wolf. I love the wolf. He's my favorite. Dog. So cool. Like this quilt is so cute. It's like I feel like this is like Tinkerville in a quilt. Yeah. It's very cool. So this is our block of the month, and as an extra bonus for this block of the month this year. So with Queen of Diamonds, I sewed along with you which I will be doing again with this quilt because I'm dying to make it. I have not made it yet. Sarah made this one. Um, but I'm also going to be in the instructional videos. It's really just a way for me to get a free trip to Australia. And by free, I mean I pay for it and I write it off. That's free to me. But um, so I'm going to Australia to, to film the videos with Sarah. And so I will be in the background of the videos being no help at all. Heckling me and generally being. Mostly, mostly. So you'll be learning from her but with me as your comedy relief companion. Jola's gonna ask all the questions that you wanna ask. Yeah. And I'm gonna answer them like she's the student, even though and she does know what she's doing. And you can so watch me get about. frustrated and and so have an answer not right. And, yeah. Anyway, it's gonna be super fun. Um, I've really enjoyed us doing these block of the months together, so we're gonna keep that going. Um, Big Woods, you guys. It's super cute. Get into it. There's lots of ways to do it. And we're going to be focusing on needle turn applique, but you can fuse it if you're like not into the handwork. You can machine sew it. Um, we'll touch on some of that. I'll probably touch on more of that because that's more my jam. Um, but we'll show you a bunch of different ways to do it. It's not like you have to needle turn it. There's different ways to do it. So. It's going to be a really good time. So no, it's the 2024, 2025 block of the month, the Big Woods with Sarah Everybody is in love with that little thing. You guys just stand in front of the quilt yeah. together.